Per usual, high school football will be popping this weekend and starting tonight with a heavy hitter in Indiana. Two of the top squads there in the state going toe to toe. Center Grove taking on Cathedral, that one at 7 p.m. Then, of course, back in our neck of the woods in Florida, St. Thomas Aquinas there taking on Cardinal Gibbons. By the way, the Chiefs looking for their second consecutive win over the Raiders, which could move them closer in that top 25. And then you can't forget out west, Centennial taking on Narc Noco at 10.30 p.m. Eastern. And then in Texas, you got Allen at Ditton Geyer, that one at 8 p.m. By the way, you might want to keep all those in tap. As I mentioned, it has something to do with the top 25. All right, time to bring in the best two-piece with a side of fries. The fellas from Max Prep, Steve Montoya and Zach Paul, check it in here with me on HQ. And let's start with the sauce here because, Zach, that's what you call it. Game of the week, Center Grove at Cathedral, both 8-0. and What are we watching here between these two? Yeah, man, this, you know, you, you look at all the games throughout the entire season, and this one is going to be one of the most evenly matched. You look at Center Grove, they check in as the number nine team in the country, they're 8 0. They've won 22 games in a row. They're the defending 6A state champs. And the team they're playing, Cathedral, they're 8 0, and they've won 21 of their last 22. That only L was a 17 13 loss at the end of the game against Center Grove last season. They're the defending 5A state champs. And if you compare these teams on paper, they're very similar. They both have big time quarterbacks. You got Danny O'Neill for Cathedral, he's one of the top 2024 gunslingers. And then you got Taven Jackson for Center Grove, he's a 2022 Tennessee commit. Both teams are great defensively. Caden Curry leads the charge for the Trojans defense. And then you look at Cathedral, they got guys everywhere, but the linebacker Jeffrey Utzinger is one of the top linebackers, one of the most underrated cats in the class of 2022. And I think what this game's gonna come down to, man, is it's gonna come down to turnovers, is what defense can force the quarterback to throw an interception here or there. I think this is gonna be a one score game. Six of the last seven have been decided by one score and they've split the last four. And if you had to put me on the spot here, I think Center Grove's gonna win this one by a field goal late. 